Today, I'm gonna to show you how to convert your signature into an SVG file using Inkscape. First, sign your name on a piece of paper. I suggest you using a 0.5 millimeter gel pen. The thicker the line, the better the result. Then, take a photo of your signature and transfer it to your computer. Open Inkscape and import the image of your signature. Click on image, then go to path chase bitmap. Under the single scan section, choose center line chasing auto chase. You can preview the chase the result here and tweak the settings as needed. If the preview isn't very clear, just click apply to see the result directly on canvas. Now click the chase the stroke and drag it away from the original image to separate them. If the lines appear too thin, go to the fill and stroke panel to adjust the stroke width. Under the stroke style table, you can set the width to something like 1 mm to make the details more visible. Double click the stroke to reveal the nodes, then left click and drag to select all of them. Navigate to path. Simplify to reduce the number of nodes while preserving the overall shape. Hold Ctrl and scroll your mouse well to zoom in and inspect the stroke details closely. The result may still need refinement. Some curves might not be smooth. There may be extra lines or parts that should be connected may appear broken. For example, if two lines are separated, click and drag a node, connect them. To remove extra lines, select a node and press delete. To smooth out curves, click on a node to reveal its handles. Drag the handles to adjust the shape. If details are hard to see, zoom in as much as needed and then make the necessary adjustments. Next, go through the rest of the signature and correct any remaining issues step by step. Now for the most complex parts. As you can see, the letter G didn't chase well and has too many messy nodes. The most efficient solution is to delete most of those nodes. Leave two main strokes and adjust them to form a clean, continuous curve. Then zoom out and reveal the entire signature. Fix other small issues. For example, align disconnected parts and remove unnecessary dots. Once you are happy with the result, delete the original image and center the cleaned up stroke on canvas. Now, save the SVG format. Next, open the UnaCAD software, set the paper size and click the SVG button to import your signature. After importing, the canvas size may change to match the SVG file. Reset it into A4 and then scroll out to zoom. Click the red arrow to resize the signature file and use the red clause at the top left to move it into the place. Clear the old files, then click current. Finally, click right and let IOT machine sign for you. Since the stroke was auto-chased, the writing order may not 
match how a human would write, but the result still looks very similar. Let's compare these two signatures. You'll see they look almost identical. So this is the most efficient way to convert your handwritten signature into an SVG file.